In 1905, Albert Einstein made what seemed at the time to be a preposterous claim. Light, he said, behaves as both a particle and a wave. The insight won Einstein the Nobel Prize. So far, several experiments have confirmed that light is indeed a wave and a particle. But not exactly. The problem is that in such experiments, light behaves either as a particle or as a wave. No one has ever found a way to see it do both at the same time. Now, scientists at EPFL have designed an experiment that makes use of the way electrons interact with light to take a photograph of its dual nature. First, the researchers shot a pulse of light onto a tiny metallic wire, basically trapping it there as a standing wave, a wave that doesn't change position over time. But remember, because of the wave-particle duality of light, the standing wave of light is also made up of particles, the photons. Now here's a question. You need light to take photos, right? But how do you take a photo of light itself? The EPFL researchers figured out a clever way to do it. They shot a stream of electrons right past the wire holding the trapped light. So close that the light and the electrons were forced to interact. Because light is made up of photons, the electrons would hit them and either slow down or speed up. This change in speed can be measured as an exchange of energy packets, or quanta, between the particles. Then, using a specialized microscope that can see electrons, well, this is really what it looks like, the researchers were able to see where this exchange of energy happens along the wire. All that was left now was to take a photo. Et voilà! The first ever snapshot of the dual nature of light. <laughs>